What's up guys, Polly Shorter back from another video, and today I have 7,154 trophies, currently top 189th in the entire world, um, with 26 days, 11 hours left the season, and today we'll be playing Classic Log Bait on Ladder. Hope you enjoyed the previous video, if you did, drop a like and subscribe, and comment down below what your favorite part of the video, or if you have any questions, I would gladly like to answer, and yeah, see you guys in the first match. Alright guys, next match we're against Zoro. Mm. For John Brill here in the corner, see what he's playing. I'm just gonna go for a log. Okay. I'm just going for a knight here on the gold knight. And rocket in case he wants to magic archer. Okay. So let's go for a high inferno tower like this to pull in the skelly barrel. Before it's off the ability, which is good. Let's go for Gom getting here and making sure everything dies. And we do get a decent counter push. Yeah, we'll force out the guard, so that's good. At least we're somewhat even on elixir and actually two guards left alone does a lot of damage so go for ice spirit yeah i know he has goblin i mean he has uh scout army maybe goblin gang or maybe fireball so gone bro that wouldn't be good but looks like i have nothing else to play really but looks like he goes aggro first okay that log was kind of bad on my end play it too far back so we get one hit on our tower I'd rather save my elixir than go in for a Gombrel because I know he's going to full counter it with something. Like a Skells army. Okay. The reason why I go with Princess right away here is to help chip out the Golden Knight quicker. I do first out a um, log. That's helpful. Um, okay, let's go for Ice Spirit like this. Let's actually surround it. Okay. Those are the cards there. Um, okay. Looks like I'm gonna eat those guards because I don't want to waste my log for them. Yeah, okay, especially he's gonna go in again. Okay, he was late on that delivery there because he did spend a lot of elixir and yeah. He transitioned, transitioned from offense to defense, like basically at the same time, so it's hard for him to get that timing right. Okay, now let's try to stack Princess because I know he has just two small spells. And we just to play good defense. Throw in our Gombro because he likes to log our princess, so yeah. I'm actually gonna log that. Dark Gob. Okay, we actually scored a lot of damage from the goblin from the behind of his tower. Princess here, go for goblin gang like this. And Okay, so far so good. Just keeping track of his stuff. Okay. It's for Gombro here. Going for a knight. I think I should have logged the Dark Goblin, but I'm not too sure about that. Let's go for Princess again for the guards. Okay, let's just want to try to go in it's for Dom Gang like this. And for another tower like so. Okay, go Knight Burnout Dash. Oh, it's going to dash for a tower, guys. Uh, okay, now now I know my mistakes. Try not to use Goblin Gang to defend the barrel. Okay, I'm going to go in hard here. Because I know he just has guards. Okay. For Ice Spirit here and Gom Gang here. Okay, we're still in this one, guys. Let's go for High Inferno Tower once again here. And Princess, like this, try to kill that Dark Gob. Okay, it's for a log here. Okay, you gotta watch out. Um, okay, let's go for a Knight here. Okay, good log again. Um, all right, it's for Gombrel here only. Let's see if he catches it. Okay, I think we get one hit there. We're going for Goblin Gang right away. Or a Dark Goblin. Okay, I need to throw a rocket to climb back and damage. Go for a high Inferno Tower here. It's going for a log as well. And Princess here to help take care of that um, Gold Knight and Skeletons. Ice Spirit does jump, so that's actually a clutch. Okay, we're actually even on damage. It's crazy. Okay, I need to log that. I'm not using my Goblin Gang. Okay. Um, okay, that Gold Knight is dangerous, so we gotta watch out. It does waste his log, which is massive. Going for another Knight here, or Log, and Princess. Okay, trying to like good build a good defense right now. 
Okay, waste his log, so I'm gonna go in for a Gomb Roll. Let's see. Okay. My Inferno Tower should kill everything. Okay, I need to rock it. Go for a log and go for Knight here. I think we should win. Climb away from the damage lead. And just like that. It's a good game. Just playing good defense there and rocket cycling him out. Also try not to give him too much log value, but I don't know why he logged our princess. Like he needed that for the Gombrel, but it's better for us, I guess. Alright guys, next match against Miner from Elite France. Let's go for a log. Okay, that was very unfortunate timing for our opponent. Because he played Princess into our log there. So I'm not gonna complain. But it's gonna be log bait, so it's gonna be a fun match here to see. We're going for a knight here and holding our goblin gang for his gone barrel because I know it's coming down soon. Okay, guys, we're aggressive. Rocket there, I don't agree on that. He's pretty low. Let's go for a goblin barrel like this. Okay. Yeah, that should get a lot of damage on the left, I mean, on the right. Nice. Uh, we're going for a high knight in case he wants a princess, ops lane, or something. All right, yeah, that's why you never want to rock it at the beginning like that. Okay, so for our princess to snipe his, yes, he doesn't have knight in hand. Okay, I'm gonna actually log that goblin gang. Okay, that's really unfortunate. Uh, missed one gob goblin, so our princess died. Okay, just for being like this. Right spirit here. He played in a good spot where he got one hit instead of no hits. But he still respawned to the Goblin Gang without E Spirit, so he has to waste his Knight there. Go for Knight right away. And. Okay, that was horrible. He doesn't have Goblin Gang. Super Goblin Bro and then Princess here. Yeah, he's gonna take a lot of damage because his hand's really bad. He's got me like this. And he has to play E Spirit into the Spirit Gobs to defend those. Because you can't be taking Spear Gob damage at all. He might predict. I mean, he might go Princess of Bridge. Let's go for Ice Bridge. Try to predict that. He doesn't. Okay. Let's go for Knight. And, okay, that was good Princess by him. But Gombro is obvious, so I'm going to call him Gang on top. I'm not going to Princess because he might, yeah, go E Spirit there. He might go for... Okay, I'm going to Rocket here. And go for knight, safety knight, in case he wants to go princess to the bridge. Okay. Um, princess down though. And I'll log that because I don't have goblin gang in hand. Alright. Yeah, I guess I need rocket cycle then. This point in the game. Okay, so princess like this. Log like this. Ice Spirit here. Okay, I go for Inferno Tower to block that. Okay, not really ideal. Okay, I'm gonna save my Goblin Gang for his. Um, okay, that's fine. Okay, wasted a log there. Okay. Uh, let's just go for Gombra Ice Spirit. Another Knight, a Pie, and Princess. Always wanna have like at least one Princess down to control the board. Alright. Um, yeah, not happy about that. He's not happy, so. I think we can rock here because we are both not even. He has to waste Inferno Tower on that. Okay. Let's go for a log here because I know it's very annoying and can defend that barrel easily. Okay. Try to do something weird. Okay, let's go for a Gom Gang like this. Pressure. Kill the Princess. You just need two rockets to win. He knows that, so I'm just gonna rock it here. Ice Spirit first to catch his princess in case he wants to play it. Um, go for a knight, always trying to have something in front of our weaker tower. Uh, going for Goblin Gang here, and then rock it for the win. That's gonna be GG, and I think his mistake was his first rocket in the beginning of the game, which like created a bad tempo. And the only mistake I made was that Inferno Tower because he kind of made us in a bad cycle, but. 